What's up guys welcome back to half men half tech so this is a quick short video that i'm making and the reason i'm making it is because of this bug that you see here so if you're on the ios 14 beta be it 14.2 beta 4 or whatever beta you are on of ios 14 every time you unlock your device this pop-up comes and shows up that says a new ios update is now available please update from the iOS 14 beta. Now, if I click close here and then just lock my device, the moment I unlock it and come back like this, you can see that this bug shows up. I can't, you know, press my home button. If you have a device that is a full screen device, you can't swipe up to dismiss this. So you have to close this in order for you to be able to do other things. Now, just to show you if i lock my device again and then you know unlock my device you can see that it's always showing up now and this is something that seems to be getting worse by the day so that's the reason for this video and just to show you here if i go into my settings and then go to general and then go to software update you can see that i'm on ios 14.2 and this is developer beta 4 so how you can quickly dismiss this bug that keeps popping up every time you unlock your device is very easy what you want to do once it pops up just click dismiss like i did so unlock your device and then dismiss the bug when it comes up and then go to your settings and then go to general and then scroll down to where you have your profiles which you've downloaded which means if you are on ios 14 beta you already have a profile section but if you are not on the ios 14 beta you won't see this profile section or if you don't have a profile downloaded so go to the profile section here and then click on the ios 14 beta profile that you have if you click on it and then you click remove once you click remove, if you have a device that has a passcode, you'll be prompted to input your passcode. And once you do that, you'll be able to remove the profile. But my iPhone 6s that I have here, since I use it to test iOS 14 betas for now, I won't be prompted with a passcode. So if I click remove here, you can see that, you know, it's now asking me to restart my device so that it completely removes the profile. Now, you don't want to do this. If you restart, if you click the restart button here, it might not completely, you know, get rid of the bug. So just say not now. And then if you go back, you know, to your settings and then go to general, you can see that the profile is no longer there. So once you You've confirmed this what you want to do is to now manually turn off your device to make sure you know it reboots up and then the profile gets removed completely so if you have an iphone that has a, a power button on the side here just hold the power button and then after some time it will prompt you to you know power off the device so just power it off like this and then if you have a device that is full screen like this iphone x that you see here you want to press the power button and you know the side volume button at the same time like this and then once you do this you'll be able to power off your device so that's how you do it once your device has been off for like you know 30 seconds just power your device back on and then you know give it some time to turn on and once you do that the profile would have been completely removed and let's give it some time as this device starts up now i've removed the profile on this device and already restarted it so let me show you what happens when i unlock the device so as you can see when i unlock this device there is no pop-up and this device is on the ios 14 beta so that's how you do it it's very easy and very simple to do so just to show you this is an on-screen device and as you can see the bug is no longer there and on the iphone 6s that you see here it's a device that isn't all screen so if i lock my device after removing the profile and then unlock my device again you can see that after some time the bug is still showing up just to show you if i go into settings and then go to general and scroll down you can see that you know we had the profile section here 
and as you can see it's no longer there but the bug is still showing up so it's a hit and miss and i don't know which devices are being affected even after removing the profile but for the iphone 6s if you remove the profile for some users it's actually working but for me as you can see it's actually not working and it's still showing up even after restarting the device so that's how it is you can see for this device that it's working and it's a quick short video that i thought i should you know just show you as it's a serious bug and quite a number of people have actually tweeted about this nine to five mark and mark rumors have also tweeted about this and even zolotech has tweeted about this now when it comes to ios 14.2 the gm version when we can expect it we were expecting like an update this week but what we got this week was actually mac os pixel 11.0.1 so if apple wants to quickly address address this issue we could see an update as early as tomorrow that is the 30th which is highly unlikely and not something that apple usually does releasing updates on a friday but apparently if this bug you know more people report it then this is you know an update that we could actually see tomorrow so do your part and also report this bug but if you know as you can see it's not something that's going to damage or you know put your device into a boot loop it's just a minor inconvenience but you know the more people that report it the sooner we get an update but when it comes to ios 14 the gm we could see an update as early as the third of november that is next week and then that is going to be the developer gm and then after like two days or so we might see the public release of ios 14.2 if the public release of ios 14.2 doesn't come during this week then we can definitely see it on this week between the 10th to the 13th so that's a small short video on how you can get rid of this bug for some devices it's working and for others as you can see it's not working so that's about it for me guys if you like this video drop a like and hit subscribe down below and stay safe and i will definitely see you in the next video very soon peace